Hello everyone, I am Aditya. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, YouTube channel Aditya's Talent Show. So I hope you are waiting for this video. Let's know more episode 2. I know I told I would be posting videos frequently but for the past one month I have been having problems with the editing and screen recording software I was using. So now it's all gone. I The problem is fixed. And here I am back with you in my new video. Let's know more episode 2. So by looking at this picture what comes to your mind? Okay, I think you have already guessed what what the video is about. It's about vegetation types of India. I thought you thought it's about something forests, but you were very close. It's about vegetation types of India. There are five major vegetation types in India. Tropical evergreen forest, tropical deciduous forest, thorn forest, tidal forest and mountain forest. Now first let's know about tropical evergreen forests. These forests are found in regions with a heavy rainfall of more than 200 cm. The trees found in this region are ebony, this is ebony, rosewood and mahogany. These trees do not shed their leaves throughout the year and they remain evergreen. That's why this forest is called evergreen forest. It's also called as tropical rainforest because there is it's always raining in these forests. These forests are found in the Western Ghats region, West Bengal, Assam, and the Andaman and Nicobar Islands. Now let's know about tropical deciduous forests. These forests are found in a region of an annual rainfall of 80 to 200 cm. These forests are found in places like the Ganga Plains, foothills of Himalayas, and parts of the Peninsular Plateau. Trees such as teak, this is these are teak trees, sal and sandalwood are grown in these forests. These trees shed their leaves in the dry season and the leaves grow back again in the monsoon season when it's raining. As you know, trees need lots of water. Now let's know about thorn forests. These forests are found in regions with very low rainfall. These are found in regions like Rajasthan, Gujarat, Punjab and Haryana. Trees like Acacia, these are Acacia trees. I, I hope many of you by seeing this tree remember the trees of Africa. These trees go in desert regions. And date trees are also grown here. These are the dates which we eat. And groundnut trees. Actually groundnut isn't a big tree, it's a, just a small plant. But uh, people call it trees in some regions. And these trees are short and stunted just like I said. They are uh, short and stunted. They are like shrubs but they are actually trees. They have deep roots with thick and thorny leaves. These deep roots go deep into underground and get water from there. As, just I told, just, as I told now, these, re these forests are found in regions with low rainfall. And as I said in the previous slide, trees need lots of water. These trees adapt to the climate. Now let's know about tidal forests. These forests are found in coastal areas that go, go through tidal changes in sea level. These are found commonly in the Sundarbans region of West Bengal where Sundari trees are commonly grown. These forests are also called as mangrove forests. Now let's know about mountain forests. By hearing the name, you might guess that these trees are found in mountains. These uh, they are found in high regions like the Himalayas. In this forest, the type of vegetation changes with increase in altitude as temperature decreases with increase in height. Many varieties of trees like spruce, pine, cedar, deodar, silver fir, walnut, birch, oak, chestnut, and sal are grown here. They are found in an altitude of 1500 meter to 3300 meter above sea level. You might be thinking how are there so many varieties of trees? As I just said there is a different of or type of forest with increase in altitude. For example I have told they are found in altitude of 1500 to 3300. 
in 1500 there will be a type of forest 1300 there will be a different type of forest with different types of trees in each forest thank you for watching today's video i hope you learned something informative you learned something new most of you who have learned this in geography like this video if you like forests and subscribe my channel if you haven't subscribed it yet thank you